हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम डॉक्टर साइनाद डीएनबी सेकंड ईयर रेजिडेंट इन सर गंगाराम हॉस्पिटल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू शो यू द डे इन डे आउट ऑफ ए न्यूरो सर्जरी रेजिडेंट एट सर गंगाराम हॉस्पिटल टुडे आई केम एट 8:30 इन द मॉर्निंग आई एम सपोज्ड टू स्टार्ट माय राउंड्स एट 8:15 एंड आई एम लेट लिटिल बिट लेट टुडे यूजुअली वी टेक राउंड्स इन अ स्पेसिफिक ऑर्डर Uh, we usually start with the post op patients everyone would like to see their post op patients early in the morning uh, they can make your day or they can spoil your day also by the way and then uh, we'll see the uh, ward patients uh, who are uh, uh, likely to be uh, sick and then uh, we'll go for the icu patients and then uh, we'll see the day care patients and we'll make the discharges and uh, we'll uh, do our rounds on our own starting from 8:30 to somewhere between 8:40 uh, uh, no sorry sorry 9:45 and then our consultant comes and we uh, take rounds along the consultants for the second time also and uh, now it is uh, sharp 8:30 in the morning and uh, first of all i'll start my day by taking over कल रात को ना बहुत बिजी था बिल्कुल भी सोने नहीं मिला एक बड़ा सा पेपर ले और ओवर लेक्चर डॉक्टर मीदा फोर्थ ईयर रेजिडेंट एट सर गंगाराम हॉस्पिटल डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ न्यूरो सर्जरी मेरा दिमाग नहीं चल रहा है अभी क्योंकि रात में बहुत काम था और बहुत बिजी ड्यूटी था एंड बहुत सारे कैजुअलिटीज आए थे एडमिशन हुए और आज के लिए सारे केसेस प्रिपेयर करने थे जो ऑपरेट होने हैं प्लस बाकी सारे जो सिक पेशेंट्स थे उनको भी पूरी रात मॉनिटर करना था तो जनरली एज अ न्यूरो सर्जरी रेजिडेंट योर नाइट्स आर बिजी बिकॉज यू कैन नॉट प्रोडिक्ट एनी थिंग इन न्यूरो सर्जरी सो यू ऑलवेज हैव टू बी ऑन योर टूर्स तो अभी तो मेरा थोड़ा काम मैंने दिया है जो जो यूनिट वाले थे बंदे उनको बताया है देखते हैं अभी वो आपको आज के दिन का पूरा दिखाएंगे आगे क्या क्या होता है हाय फ्रेंड्स आई हैड जस्ट फिनिश माय राउंड इट इज 10:30 थर्टी ए एम ऑलमोस्ट एंड नाउ आई नीड टू अटेंड द जनरल ओपीडी हियर इन द जनरल ओपीडी uh residents get a uh, lot of free hand to see the cases uh it is one of the good opportunities uh, i would say actually i uh, am back to duty room had uh, already taken my uh, rounds i had been to general opd i took the rounds with the consultants and i had seen few cases in the casualty and uh, now i have a long list of works to do Uh, i have uh, some dressings to do and uh, some drains to be removed and i have a few patients in the casualty whose investigations have to be followed and um, i have a lumbar puncture to do and uh, there are few bedside procedures and um, i hope i should be doing all this um, by 3 pm so that i could uh, start my evening rounds early uh, today i am not on call actually uh, so my target is to complete all these works by 4 pm and then start my rounds at 4 so that uh, i can uh, complete my work by 6 pm and then give over so that i can leave home early by 6 pm usually uh, we have two kinds of uh, postings for the residents um, uh, one is the ward posting uh, today i am making video on that and the other one is the ot posting um we are not sorry we will not be able to show you uh, uh, what's going on in the vote uh, on youtube um, but uh, i'll just uh, uh, tell you in my words uh, in uh, uh, what posting uh, the things and the responsibilities we have i'm going to share this on this video um, uh, the rest all in uh, the vote posting i'll just uh, give you a brief about that Uh, we usually attend uh, ot early by uh, we would be reaching by 8 am in the morning and then um, uh, we'll be uh, seeing assessing the patient preoperatively and then uh, take the patient inside the ot get him induced and then uh, we'll start the procedure uh, we'll discuss the plan with the consultants and uh, we will do all the uh, opening and uh, 
uh, we'll uh, expose the operative site uh, so that the uh, consultants uh, come and do the main part and then uh, we'll be assisting the consultant throughout the whole surgery um, it is uh, uh, it is only one assistant in our ot uh, consultant plus one uh, assistant uh, there is no assistant to here uh, so that would be a great opportunity to learn because um, uh, head on interaction with the consultant it is definitely uh, useful uh, we all feel and then um, uh, we'll uh, close the patient and uh, extubate put ot note uh, and then assess the patient post operatively and take a small break and get ready for the next surgery usually we do uh, usually the butilist uh, uh, it be like uh, three to four surgeries uh, in a day and uh, we have two residents posted in the OT for that purpose and um, on an average you will be able to operate uh, two patients uh, per day so that's yeah. average and it can go up to three to four and it can go up to five also de depending upon the list but the average is two patients per day hi uh, i'll introduce you to the rest of the residents of our department here we go hi i'm dr devesh well first year resident in the Department of Neurosurgery at Sir Gangaram Hospital. So I'm through with my rounds and I've done uh, most of my work. I still have some file work to do and after that I have to go discuss some uh, MRIs with the radiologist so that we can plan for surgery for the patients. After that I'll take my lunch break and then I'll do my evening rounds. Uh, then I, on the evening I'm on call so I'll see all the patients who are getting admitted for tomorrow or day after and I'll attend all the emergency calls that come. Devish, you forgot about your class. You have a class? Yes, sir. Today's class is So I have an academic class on the base of skull anatomy at 2 a.m. at 2 p.m.